as I've said, no, I mean, I've, I've just got into yeah. that, that's it. Trust Annette, the Ray Trader, our talkers, and yeah. This is a running Of pattern. course, the day that we need a lot of uh, social skills, he doesn't show up. But the day we have a lot of firepower, we can shoot things. Oh, yes. <laughs> Lots of firepower. There is, of course, also that option. We can yes. just shoot the city fucker. Well, why don't, you try intimidating, <laughs> why don't we try intimidating him first, and then shoot him if he doesn't get intimidated? Alright, yeah, I'll give it a shot. Alright, um, politely reminding him that we are, in fact, the officers and well, not gentlemen, but servants of the actual rogue trader who runs this planet, and therefore allowing us to see his son would probably be a wise decision for anybody who works for him, technically. The awesome question. So, making a roll on... 58. Alright. Succeeded by a degree. Yeah, he's a bit nervous. He's, he's a church person, but he's not, like, 100% church, so... The, you know, the fact that you you've carrying probably more weaponry than his entire you know ten man squad is worrying him. <laughs> what are these guys armed with? Actually, out of interest. Um, these guys have got auto guns. Right. Okay. Wait, how the hell did they get auto? Because remember, we got that huge box of auto guns a few weeks back. I guess we must have given them them for do a colors. Well, I know this is some years ago. But they've been trading on their own. Oh yeah, we did. did. Yeah. No, they provide did. this on their own. Most of the other troops have been carrying las guns. Um, these guys have got auto guns. Obviously, because they're right, protected. So we can get inside then? Aren't and auto guns just like rifles? Yeah, they're pretty much high, uh, 50 caps. They're M16, M4s, that sort of stuff. But yeah, yeah, did that get us in? Yes, I got you in. Marvelous. We'll shoot it later. Yeah. <laughs> so. <laughs> um. Oh, well. Oops. So, inside is quite well laid out, and, um, yep, there is a young boy sitting in the room, who you're going to assume is, um, uh, that's the one I was going to use, so. Little Ish. Yeah, little little Ash. Uh, he's flat-footed, I shoot him. Micro Ash. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, wow. <laughs> Uh, start combat. <laughs> start that combat. hell of a surprise party. round. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. so you, you've just got broken in, you're here to rescue him, how are you going to introduce yourself? Congratulations, you are now the ro the captain of our ship. <laughs> <laughs> the old one went insane. <laughs> no, the old one is now the uh, planetary governor. Well, no, wouldn't... He, well, maybe we shook him off of it with the demon in his bedroom. <laughs> he realized he we needed to get up, up so that he doesn't want to travel anymore. That's how it works. Yeah, sort of. At least he's drunk so much he's now become permanently pissed. <laughs> yeah, there is no such <laughs> thing as surprise. A uh, zealot. Oh yes. Kick Bishop Brennan up the house. And this thing's still loading. Yeah, just oh. Oh, there it goes. How big is that, then? There we go, apparently. <laughs> Alright, so where are the guards? Uh, they're outside. Oh, good. So you're alone in the room with him. This seems like a really efficient guard detail. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's make sure the VIP is really protected, lads, by leaving nobody nearby. Okay, the other side of the door. Awesome. They have just let the heavily armed people in. Yeah, you know, who say they work for his dad? <laughs> <laughs> but this well, sounds like Ash's kind of people. <laughs> yeah. All right, like so people. <sighs> let us introduce ourselves. I am just by name and whatever. Yep. So that we're at least on name basis. Yeah, exactly who we are and what we did for your dad. And what we are now technically doing for you, I guess. Does it work that way? Family contract? I guess. Yeah, you, you, you the he Lick owns you, this. basically. Can we ransom him place. to ourselves? That'd be a pricey one. That'd be a price. Is this it's ever going to load? It's loaded. Uh, why is there a jail cell? I think that's his bed. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? Oh, P-H-M. I haven't noticed the weird cell thing at the bottom. 
Admittedly, nor did I. Just, you know, consider that that's like your playroom and then that <laughs> side at the bottom is where you actually sleep. I, I think that's <laughs> locked up when they come in to put the food down. You've <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> been childhood, haven't you? Alright, so a nice introduction saying, yep, congratulations, you are now the rogue trader. I don't believe you. <laughs> well, we can always bring your dad down to sh uh, prove it. I mean, he's a little bit pissed right now. Uh, <laughs> oh, wait, you're too young to know about booze, aren't you? Oh, don't worry, we'll bring him down anyway. Uh, there's an explanation coming. You'll understand when you're 16. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the next version you can have it in, in 10 years. When you're actually old enough to get pissed, we'll explain what it means. Oh, that's like one <laughs> Wop Jump. Oh, God, it probably is, yeah. Uh, well, yeah. Who who are you? We are the officers of your father's former employ. You are now officially the head of the Bashara Rogue Trader Dynasty since he has become indisposed, indisposed for want of a better word. Well, not technically indisposed. He's decided that he wants to settle down. I has I'm chosen to you to uh take over the take over the lineage. Definitely not believing you. <laughs> Reasonable enough to believe a word of Can I refer to him? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> oh my right, episode title. Oh. Yes. Oh. Oh. That is gonna be the episode title. Session ten, shall I reprogram him? <laughs> oh, bloody. Do you, do you just want me to come and make another public appearance? Well, a public appearance to begin with, yes. I mean, we do have a few things which you need to do first, but we do also happen to have... Wait, have we actually... Sorry, this is out of character. Have we actually found Ish at this point? What's left? <laughs> <laughs> Possibly. I, mean, I, I, I assume yet. he's just circulating through the air vents at this point. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, clothing. He's in the crate after him. Hiding in the ceiling above the women's showers. <laughs> <laughs> the, the crew just might have wondered why he's stalking without eating. Uh, we do actually, I think it's a fair point, we do need to actually have some proof to do, uh, let alone that he is now officially a head bash rather than a little bash. That sounded far better. Um, what have you done to the men outside? Nothing yet. We can if you want. <laughs> they, oh, they let you in? <laughs> they haven't let anyone in for years. Well, in all fairness, they do respect the authority of your father, uh, the man who set this colony up. I thought he was dead. Dead? No. Who absolutely. told you that? Well, well the, the, the... What's he calling himself at the minute? Um, uh, Chief Bishop or something like that. <laughs> Get him. <laughs> I don't know. I've got no idea what the planetary title for a, a crazy priest would be in the 40k universe. I'll say the, the, the Cardinal. Yeah. Cardinal oh, will, means Richard, okay. yeah. So the Cardinal told you that your father was dead? Yeah. He's almost. This happened to be Cardinal. I did, I, I'm assuming we knew the name of the guy when we Octorus. made him. It's it's Rushford, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for getting that. <clears throat> thank puts, you. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Thank you for that. Um, put simply, yes, your father is still alive. I'm not there may be a reason or not as to why the Cardinal said otherwise. We'll work that out as we go. Suffice it to say, your father is alive, but no longer of his own volition, willing oh God. <laughs> for multiple reasons, which the GM has not necessarily determined. <laughs> He'll not come to permanent alcoholism. And 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 my mother. That's a little. He had a mother. <laughs> <laughs> she might. Actually, picked just one. Um, how do I put this? We know that she is somewhere on a planet relatively nearby, but she is not of the correct standing. 
As far as I remember, didn't we work out she was a whore on Solace? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, you basically, you, basically you say, know which house I, she's from. Yeah, you can find the like, brothel, like, but yeah, that's about it. So we, <laughs> I like to think you said that just in character. <laughs> <laughs> Which is unsubtle, he's not quite that stupid. Um, yes, I, I'm sure we could find your mother, actually, in all fairness, but she didn't want to come along on this particular voyage. For reasons which, again, we will explain when your father is found. And, 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 when and Janik? <laughs> Gannick? Was that sorry? I. Gannick. Oh, Gannick. Yes. Um... Why, why, my friend Gannick. Is he the leader of this world? <laughs> he, he. No, no, he's my friend. Where? What does your friend look like? Um, he's he's well. I don't know. I haven't really seen him for about eighteen months. Well, he's not that much of a friend, though. Man. Okay. Why, why haven't you seen him for 18 months? Well, they, they said his dad was a heretic, so he couldn't come and see me anymore. Okay. By the way, as you drove in, um, you did notice quite a few, like, pies. Yeah, a couple of thousand. A couple, couple of dozen pies, you said? Thousand pies. Okay. Well, I okay. should have expected that which was easy on to say. Um, put it this way, uh, Mr. Gannick is currently indisposed. <laughs> uh, we don't know, mostly because we just got here. We are here to pick you up and see what to the disposition of this planet. Obviously, some things need to change if there are purges are, that, are, like this. Are you going to restore the proper church? Part of it, yes. <laughs> Proper. <laughs> Proper might be stretching it a bit, but hey, I'm here to put, uh, bring up the cult of the Omnissiah. Yeah, you know why is you know. there two of Sebastian? Because I'm just doing it's a bit of paperwork. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! What the hell is Father what? Jack doing back? <laughs> <laughs> what is the Jack gonna top out of a star? <laughs> Because I didn't lock the level. <laughs> if I don't lock the layers, it will have a top half top added moustache. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is our villain, ladies and gentlemen of the Let's Play. We are trying to bring down this evil man who looks like a fucking comic book NPC. <laughs> he bleach for half his life and toilet duck the other half. Oh, God in heaven. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to launch into a short lecture about the differences between the classical imperial creed and the one they're following on this planet at the minute. Aubrey's mind switches off. I'm, <laughs> I'm just sitting here thoughts, yeah? considering the implications of giving a nine-year-old his own personal band of sycophant sociopaths. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds like a recipe for success. That, yeah. yeah, that's the question. I have no clue. You, you, also forgot, you also forgot the city-sized starship with enough firepower to level the city. <laughs> yeah. And oh the uh, r roughly gender-balanced crew. Yeah. <laughs> it's only nine. For now. For, for now. He also but, technically owns the planet you live on. Yeah. <laughs> You're so, on. Yeah. The long story short Which, is he is... <laughs> God. He is about to take the biggest power trip ever. Yeah. <laughs> well, one of the biggest power trips that a nine year old has taken. And he doesn't have a regent in this case. Nope. Uh. Yeah. No, that's the thing. The bunch of sycophantic psychopaths are his regents. Yeah, we are. You're the regent she council. And the only thing I could think of that it comes closest to an absolute regent would be trust. <laughs> his senator. Oh, God, the puns. Yes. Little oh year old here is going to be brought up as a pungent master, and we all know it. <laughs> I, oh, God. But the I may <laughs> want oh, to retarget the macro strike cannon. <laughs> <laughs> I, I am quite happy to accompany you as long as I can bring my library with me. Yes, I'm. We've got a pretty you big library. <laughs> uh, sure, you can bring your library with us. And, and um, comic book collection. Oh yeah, yes, that's you. And that's about 30 boxes, right? 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> the library is. Trust me, we've got an even larger li librarian on our on board the ship. Yeah. Or makes a personal note to make damn sure his own personal literature is removed before the nine-year-old gets in. Does, does, does it have anything about orcs in it? Plenty of things. Yes. Yeah, I should think so. No doubt. Wow. They're funny. No picture books, though. <laughs> we'll work on that. I'm sure we've got the um, uh, Guardsman's Primer. Yep. <clears throat> Guardsman's Primer. Better use this toilet paper. Um, <laughs> so you're about to die for the Emperor. Are, are you insulting the divine word of our Imperial Masters? No, I no. just know someone who is. He doesn't work with us anymore for exactly that reason. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> the, the, the door opens and one of the guards looks in. Yeah, Hello. Yeah, I kind of think you should be moving on now. Hi. <clears throat> uh, yes. Right, what are you doing out your cage? You didn't lock it oh, okay. the best last time. <laughs> so, so, well, once these guys are gone, you're going back in there for two days. Charming. Um, Would you at least give me a bucket this time? <laughs> What's wrong with the last bucket? Well, it doesn't have a bottom. <laughs> <laughs> It's more of a cube. <laughs> yes, things are definitely going to change. <laughs> yes. Yes, I think so. Um, <laughs> at this point. Right, you lot, fling you rock. Okay, gladly. Um, has Sinky up the teleportarium at this point? Uh, Sinky can have a go at firing up the teleportarium. <laughs> That's my job, Gray. Teleportarium. <laughs> yes. What am I rolling, rolling, rolling against then? Pushing all the buttons, basically. Yes, that would be a tech <laughs> use. Oh, cock. That would be a tech use that I don't have any of because it's a trained skill. Cock. Um, <laughs> I can talk him through it. <laughs> Actually, that's the point. All we yeah. have to do is stall long enough for Macarius to explain what the buttons do. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll, I'll say that Macarius has brought the little transponder thing and Macarius can make the tech roll. Oh, thank God. For okay, good. Yes, so, tech use. Yeah. Uh, Currently, my tech use is 70. Um, Can I assist, seeing as I also have tech use? Yeah. Okay, so that's a plus 10. Um, do I get to use my tools and stuff? Uh, yeah. How are you going to use your tools when you're not on the ship? His mecha I'm mecha using it on the... Uh, whatever the hell the thing is, the transponder thingy. He's like plugging himself into the transponder. Basically, Thanks. I'm using the machine spirit and all that nice stuff and... Let's see, that's, uh, MIU gives me plus 10 to tech use. Oh, what's this? Yes. Keep going, you dice roll while you... Yeah, roll your dice. Yeah. Uh, once it stops freezing, you just froze the game. Oops, ah, there we go. <laughs> Perform right of percussive means. <laughs> Smack it! <laughs> that is perfect. But, um... <laughs> oh, I want, to, I want to say that. <laughs> All right. Currently I'm rolling against 110. If you botch this, I slap you. 65. Yeah, you're all going to get teleported out. Um, yes, we're leaving now. Wow. Well, well, that's exactly what we're doing. Yep. I am screaming because this is terrifying. Yep, yeah, I've oh, got shit. no idea. Not just explain yeah, it. Yeah, we're to leaving him. now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, just, we're getting just all baseball right here. Just to end things on a high note, I throw a crack grenade into the room before we teleport <laughs> out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like you. <laughs> Why a crack grenade? They're not armored. <laughs> Just because. <laughs> okay. It makes a it makes a deep hole, a small one, but a deep one. We also had the uh, comic books brought on with us. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah I'm but sure you pick them up. Yeah, the teleportarium should be big. Right, big back nice yep. Okay, so it's um, Bash's first time off the off planet, and he's teleporting. <gasps> <to the teleportarium. gasps> Who forgot to explain what how we What the fuck was that? <laughs> By the way, who am I, who am I killing? <laughs> I would like to point out that the teleportarium is where you store the murder servitors. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they're just, they're just sitting around the room. Uh, they're okay. hidden behind stuff by uh, panelling and the like. They're hidden behind boxes of comics. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he, he told us to have the teleportarium ready for anything, so the panels are open. Yeah. Why are you doing? To deploy. 
Why? And of course, there are a large amount of crew sitting on it. Yeah, oh, waiting. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's, there's half the crew squad that aren't looking for Ash are all waiting to be beamed down. Oh, there are crew here. Alright, we're going to have to. A bunch uh, of um, <laughs> yeah, smells weird. Sweet, so now we've got ourselves the last thing that we need to do. Uh, somebody with good. We're going to have Trust off screen uh, help him out with the whatever, the explanations. Yeah. You, you calm me down. <laughs> get, get a drink. Totally fine. Fine. I'm, I'm, I'm now Because if it co worst comes to worst, I will use Medicaid on him. <laughs> it falls to bed rest. <laughs> yeah, I'm, that I'm, could work. I'm, I'm going to assume we left a pilot with our shuttle and he's bringing it back to the ship as well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because Sam, we're, not, we're not using the Voyager system of just magically <laughs> making our shuttles. We've got a second. <laughs> Okay. Yes, boys, yeah, we only have two shuttles and they crash about ten. Yep. Actually, did you get a free shuttle by killing those guys earlier? Yeah, we actually picked one up. Yeah, that was <laughs> yeah. Although you may want to so return that to the planet afterwards, because that would be their only shuttle. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. Okay, so you've managed to reunite yourself. You now have a rogue trader. You're allowed to operate. Yes, we've been... Wait, we've been operating illegally? This entire... Oh, dear. Oh, well, not technically illegally. <laughs> we just couldn't find them. Yeah, okay. He's, he's been on the ship. So you know, <laughs> and we didn't do much, so... Yeah, we got lost for another five years. I suppose, actually, on the scale of things, it's not too bad. <laughs> but, yeah, so, you, it's not like you've been anywhere that, you know, someone's asked to see your qualifications. We're or really going to have to bring Little Bash up to speed quickly, aren't we? That's why I'm saying do it off screen. Just have Trust yeah. explain it while he's not here. Yeah, yeah, we can t we can sort that later. Oh god. Okay, so your last problem happens to look like Father Jack. Well, given that we've got Little Bash out, can we just level the bastard's house with him in it? I'm saying that we should just surgically strike and kill them all. This of course. Well, wouldn't leveling his house do that, and then we teleport Bash down, and problem solved. Well, because. Uh, orbital bombardments are not that uh, close. Oh, we don't want to destroy the rest of the city. You wouldn't destroy the rest of the city. Maybe another block or so. It's a single shot. Yeah. <laughs> and and well, unless and we're miss. also rolling against our ballistic skills here. And what about well, come on, folks? <laughs> what if um, we miss? Yeah. And we will miss. You, you quick, can't hover now. Quick. Yeah, I, I'm rolling against nice. a 64 before, before, with a, yeah. before foreshadowing, because I've prepared it. That's why I said I'm preparing the strike. Yep. Well, hold on, quick question. Um, what ammunition do Lance batteries run off? Uh, the sun, the sun strikes a laser cannon. Okay, okay. Do we have, do we have any uh, large shell munitions? You have the macro cannon. Okay, so what about we place some debt on the shell of a macro cannon and teleport it into their house. Uh, it pretty much is detonated. Okay, do that! I'd like to re re bring this picture up again and um, remind <laughs> you at the size of isn't a bloody macro cannon shell. Isn't it just a giant lamp of iron or something? I don't think it actually has any explosives in it. Yeah, true, yeah. Okay. Okay, okay. Why don't we just drop <laughs> it? We teleport it a certain distance above the guy's house and just let gravity do the hard work. <laughs> this guy, this guy gets it. Dry. Do that. Do that. Let physics work? Yeah. Yes. Precisely. Just put it upside down on the pad, teleport it like 300 feet above the house, go. Problem solved. How big, how big is the teleportarium? Um, it's enough. big enough. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's pretty large. It's, a, uh, it's an entire room, basically. Big That's one. all you need to know is big enough. Do this plan now, or I quit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so would someone like to make me another tech use roll if we're going to drop a shell? Roger one? that. Let's see what I do. It's against, uh, with the help, right? Yep. Alright, so again, drop 110. Drop and shell on the town hall. Fucking hell, oh. I needed that 110. <laughs> almost a debauched territory. <laughs> You almost Chuck jammed break. the teleportarium. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been a fate roll, so... Yeah. It still succeeded, though. Yep, yeah, you splat yeah. the church. 
them with a, a shell that's, that's probably the size of a house. <laughs> doesn't, that be, doesn't that the style of this is the light of the Emperor striking him down? No, this is the great piece of metal of the Emperor's flat. This is the Emperor's <laughs> mailed fist. Well, there was a there was a very large light when it teleported into existence 300 feet in the air. Yeah, yeah. So... it's almost like a cartoon anvil, but bigger. <laughs> you know, the, the Emperor the did not like him. Um, All right, let's, that's let's actually give... going to stay there now. Unless someone starts disassembling it for the raw metal, there'll just be this great big shell. <laughs> Where well, the sure. I'm okay with that. I'm well, now they'll just start worshipping the shell. Oh, shit, mm. it's a Megaton situation. Only less the nukes. The crew inform me that they found Esh and they're just piling him into the shuttle and we'll give him a few honor yeah. guard and he's going plant side. Yeah. And possibly yeah. one hell of a lot of Soberals. Mm. Did you just destroy a temple to the Emperor? No. no. I destroyed a temple no. to a cult. That's entirely different. Thank exactly, thank and one that's not uh, Inquisition not uh, authority. Not Ecclesiarchy sanctified. Exactly. It's the wrong kind of cult, you see. I'll, I'll accept that. I'd like actually having a moral person on our crew who he could just completely <laughs> bullshit. It actually adds a certain element of realism. Yeah. <laughs> Basically everything you go, is that right? Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah completely. <laughs> yeah. Oh god. Right, um, we have to find Ash and the colony shuttle and he can sort the rest of the mess out. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be an interesting morning for him. Um, um, I'm <laughs> that now. We, in we inform him that... The, He's um, now the planetary we governor. Well, you inform me that his alcohol is coming on the next shuttle. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> let let him know before he goes that he can hire our services to remove that shell if he'd so choose. <laughs> no, no. Why would we do that? <laughs> I guess there's, there's, the there's, the there's raw material there to create loads of stuff. Exactly. Yeah. Raw material there to make stills out of. <laughs> and now he has the actually has the raw material to make his planes. Yes, that's another point, actually. The there Eternal we go. Air Force. Okay. okay. I mean, it is named Belko places, so it's going to have to have an airport. <laughs> oh, wait. No, I was going to see if I could do an inquiry in the librarian for the next few days of seeing if there's anything at all on the walk out here. Do you know, make our walk jump rolls slightly less horrible. Yeah. Oh, well, we should have a... Well, I think you've... I probably a way of doing that um, by jump, so every time you want to make a jump, if you want to have a look at, um, no, we've been playing on that one, um, you know, every time you want to make a jump, you can look to see if you've got walk charts. Well, on the plus it. side, uh, at least nobody drew a top hat on the uh, shot. <laughs> the mustachioed shell. I wouldn't have been shocked, to be honest. I've just locked the drawing way <laughs> probably a good idea. Probably a they, good idea. Uh, probably don't make top hats idea. that yeah. big. Yeah. Well, damn it, they should. Okay, so. Um, what I'm going to do now is basically say you've recovered Belka and it's, it's grown quite nicely since you were last here. Yeah. Which means your profit factor is about to go up. Oh, hurrah! Goody. I'm going to say it's While that gold. happens. Yeah? Well, ha that happens. We're dropping off our um, half our orbital defense batteries. Yep, you're setting up three orbital defense batteries. Uh, Actually, sorry, I've just had a sudden realization. Given the reliability of our warp um, travails, someone needs to explain to Little Bash just how drunken our navigator should be and how bad she is when she's not. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. You, you've had no uh, no sense of surprises. Oh yes, he no, needs some surprises. I really don't. I don't like bad surprises. Alcohol is a vice that should be avoided. Yeah, we'll, get you, we'll get you fixed about that. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm I'm the one that came up with the hitting the machine spirits hard, and I don't even do that. <laughs> I do. Cheers. I just assume it's genetic. So. Alcohol is genetic. Ooh, I must come from a family of brewers. <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> family <laughs> brewers. It's all purple and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Genetic schnozberries. <laughs> Schnozberry schnaps. I still hate. I still hate Tarosa. Come on. <laughs> so much. Yeah. 
Yeah. It's been a convenient excuse to explain where I've been at times I've been missing, but still. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so, should we risk another warp jump? We can go to, uh, risk Terra Nova again, see if we can't get another sh another shot of just going straight to there. <laughs> what, so we can if actually wanna, directly plot a route? If you, if you want to do a direct jump, sure, we can do a direct one. Or you could just do the four days of, um, like, interjump. Do sol solace and then have to deal with that. Yeah, uh, what I'll do is if you're going to use stable warp jumps, I'll just total the, the lot up and work off that. Ah. So, if you're going to yeah. use stable ones. Alright. So, if we do that, then we can even use the computer. That's actually another good point, yeah. Which is tech use, which I have a hundred of. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we'll, you'll be struggling to put into tech use, basically. Yeah. Though we still do have to make a navigate check. <laughs> 